Apparently, trivia nights are the place to be for some people around St. Louis. So I'm here at one benefiting Our Ladies Inn at Chaminade Prep School, trying to figure out what the big deal is. People are always looking for an excuse to get together with their friends. And if we're too old to play on the football field or the basketball court, this is a way, you know, a way to be competitive. You have some people who are really intense. Other people just want to see what they can remember and, and just have fun. There's usually always a science round and a history round, a couple pop culture rounds. You get pictures of celebrities from when they were young. You have to identify who they are. Different music, pieces of music, and you have to identify who the uh, singer or songwriter was. <laughs> so a few little different types of things besides just straight question and answers. Typically, every trivia night is raising money for some worthy cause. On happy days, what was Ponzi's nickname for Johnny? Most popular colors for highlighters are yellow and pink. Just by participating in the trivia night, they are helping shelter women who would otherwise be living on the street. It also gives us an opportunity to bring people in who may not know about our mission to you know, teach them about what it is we do. They're participating in our mission by coming to Trivia Night. Another wrong answer. He said it with conviction. He's over 15.